Yo, Band of Future fans, what's up? Um, so the first question we begin, we be getting. Hey. We be getting. First question we be getting. <laughs> first question we be getting foods and this. What your name is? Your mama can a brother holler at you. Holler, holler, holler. Holler at you. Holler, holler at you. Holler, 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 holler. Um. <laughs> so the first question that we've been getting is um, about your phone number. This is a temporary thing. It's a temporary contest just through the month of April. Once the contest ends in May. Um, we're getting rid of that phone number. We're getting rid of your phone numbers. You won't be getting any more text messages after the contest. I'll call him and, um, and I'll yell at him, you know, and try to get him to stop. The second thing, to actually vote. Being on the voting list is like step one. Thank you for doing that. Step two is actually doing the voting. So you'll get a link once a day via text that gives you the website of the John Lennon Awards. And then on that website, you can actually click to vote for your boys band in future. So make sure that you do that. Because you haven't voted if you're just on the list. You gotta actually click the link and then once a day for all of April, you can do it. You can vote for your boys band in future on the, the John Lennon Awards website. And uh, the last thing is uh, that some people have had um, problems voting where you get an error message that said that you already voted for the day, and you can't vote anymore. Um, so what's happening is uh, what they do to protect the integrity of the contest is that they limit the number of IP addresses that can vote. What? Um, so, for example, if you're on the same IP uh, uh, huh? network. Um, Bro, what are you talking about, man? So basically, you can't sit at one computer with a thousand different email addresses and just vote, 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 vote. Oh, I get it. So, um, say you're in a family or something, and, and all of you are on the same like Wi-Fi network or same cellular network. Um, it might just allow one of those devices to vote. So, what you would have to do is get on another network. So, say if you were on your cell phone network, um, someone else in your family could vote on your home Wi-Fi network, and so you could get both of those votes in. Uh, so hopefully that makes sense uh, to you guys. If it doesn't, um, just shoot us an email at bandedfuture at gmail.com and we'll uh, clear it up for you. Starbucks, coffee bean, Panera bread, any place that has Wi-Fi, maybe you frequent, you can do that too. Your local library. Oh, people, they still have those? The more you know. Is that the song? <laughs> Reading rainbow. See, I was going to confuse those two, but it wasn't. I thought it was the more you know, and then there's like a ding 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 ding, like the you know, syllables. That might be right. Why isn't LeVar Burton hosting Jeopardy? We should be outraged. Oh, dang, that's a great idea. Yeah. Start a petition. Petition your local senator or uh, whoever is responsible for it. Because they have nothing else to do. Uh, shout out to LeVar Burton. We were in the same room once. What? Well, he didn't know, but I wasn't there. <laughs> <laughs> I was aware of him, he wasn't aware of me. I guess that counts, man. It does, I think so. Vote for us. Vote for us, everyday fools. Mafro, I don't know what this is. Is this a presidential thing? <laughs> I'm just gonna like, do this gesture for a while. 